Hey guys, what's going on? Church, we are back from the video today. We are doing some more hog stuff. First of all, I want to give you a call. Is first of all, I'm sorry for the video being late. Um, I didn't have the chance to record it yesterday, so that's why we're a little late. Um, saying them all, there are also elimination games last night. We'll go over that in a little bit. Now, actually, we'll go over those games. And then third, the plan overall for today are about should be about 30 to 40 minute episode. Um, our plan for today is going to be to basically establish elimination games, go over my bracket again, once again, and react to how I'm doing right now. And then my last plan is going to be, assuming it works, is going to be doing the spin wheel prediction challenge for my next year's season um, to see who makes it out of the playoffs and, uh, and who is crowned the eventual, the eventual Stanley Cup final. The way we're going to do a lot of your asking is how are you going to do this? So what we're going to do is going to take all 32 teams and basically they're going to be eliminated. So essentially the way it's going to work is a team, this are 32 teams, essentially the team that has the, so let's say, um, take the Chicago Blackhawks. Let's just take all the 32 teams. So the way it's going to work is spin the wheel and the one that it is is the winner of that wheel gets a point, gets advances the winner advances so basically the winner already is in the playoffs and we get 16 teams now technically since they're deciding the stanley cup playoffs who is the stanley cup champion the order doesn't matter obviously and there's not going to be any matchup so Top 16 advance, the other 16 are eliminated. So, yes, it could be all Eastern Conference teams or Western teams. But that's extremely rare. Extremely rare. So, yeah, that's the plan for today. And then um, we are going to, by the way, also have uh, some more plans to say. So, let's get started with hockey news first. As you guys know, that's what we are going to start up with. So under the hockey news, um, we do have some big news coming in this week. First of all, Barry Trotz from the New York Islanders has been fired. Um, once again, the Barry Trotz has been fired from the New York Islanders. So possible locations could be Detroit, maybe, I think, for Barry Trotz. It'd be embarrassing, though, if um, Trotz was actually able to do that. So Trotz actually has a chance. Um... The next one is the Penguins ruled out Sidney Crosby for Game Six of the Stanley Cup playoffs against the New York Rangers. The Crosby out. I feel like there's gonna be a little bit of a choke here um, between Crosby and that. So that's big news coming in today that Crosby has been ruled out. The third news is Tom Wilson is also ruled out. So, yeah, they're dead today right now. So, I'm hoping Cindy Crosby will be back for Game 7 because that's going to create a huge Game 7. But I feel like Game 6 is going to go the Rangers' way tonight, unfortunately. So, once again, if you're just tuning in, sorry for the late video. Um, I didn't have time to record it, and there are a bunch of elimination games. So now it's time to get my it's time to get into elimination game. So we do have a lot of elimination games that were played last night and teams that have won. So again, I'm gonna have to pull up my bracket here. So let's let you open the bracket. I'm gonna pull it up now, and yeah, let's get into it. So obviously, you guys saw me in my bracket prediction video that I created many brackets. So the final one I've decided to use is actually going to be the one, um, is this one here where I had a bunch, so, of teams. I'm going to use it as, oh, and so, now a lot of you are like, oh, you did that yesterday. Only after the fact that I gave you, it, I, only after the fact that, um, only after the fact that you gave the, that the game actually happened. No, I didn't, I used plan on using it before it just never happened um but i was going to use this one before anyway with the new york rangers winning the stanley cup so here as we can see we do have 
So let me just reread over my predictions, whether they're right or wrong. So going to the Western, I had Nashville in seven, Minnesota in seven, Dallas in seven, LA in seven. For the Eastern Conference, I knew starting up to watch Florida. Washington in seven. Toronto in seven. A lot of people are going to kill me for that pick for sure. It's probably going to go haywire um, tomorrow night. I'm going to watch that game for sure. Boston in seven. That one's staying actually pretty alive considering tomorrow's Boston game, right? Yeah. So Boston is actually pretty alive right now. So I'm actually feeling confident about that pick. And I have the New York Rangers in seven again, but still alive. We, if we win tonight, we are through to game seven in MSG, Madison Square Garden, which means a game seven would occur. So, yes, I do have a chance at getting all these brackets right um, as of now. And, again, I am not very happy. So, let me go over the things I got wrong. I got Nashville wrong and Nashville in seven. Colorado absolutely demolished the Carol, uh, Nashville Predators, so they won in four, so that's the wrong year to have a Colorado game. Minnesota St. Louis, Minnesota beats so this. They lost to St. Louis yesterday 5 to 1, which resulted in St. Louis winning yesterday, which resulted in them clinching home ice. I had Minnesota in seven, which resulted in them clinching on home ice to the second round of the playoffs, so we'll have St. Louis, Colorado. Now, if you remember, if I remember last year, actually, yeah, last year it was Colorado beating St. Louis in four. Um, actually, I believe that was even in the first round. So St. Louis is out in the first round. Is St. Louis a Stanley Cup contender this year? Well, according to my bracket, no, but maybe. So, um, I also have Dallas on seven, which is going well over Calgary. They need to win tonight to force that. St. Louis and six is terrible right now for me. It's Minnesota and seven. Dallas and seven going well for now. And LA and seven going well for now. It's actually funny right now how all the Eastern Conference games, like all of them, all the series went to, you know, it went to, um, it was game seven. Um, no team advanced in six. So it's crazy how that happened. Um, Obviously, Florida, Washington right now, I can't say that's going to seven right now. So, Washington needs to win tonight to go to seven in Washington. So, Toronto also won, uh, needs to win tomorrow night. So, basically, all the series are fun to game seven, except for New York and the Washington series. But I feel like it actually has a chance of going to game seven. Um, next up, that's it for bracket predictions. Next up, we're going to... Hockey spin the wheel. So give me a second. I'm gonna open up the spin wheel and we'll get started. Uh, give me a minute to search NHL team spin wheel. Team spin the wheel. I'll be right back. Just give me a second and I'll be right back. I'm um, sorry for the delay, but I'll be right back.
Hey guys, I'm back. Sure, we are back again. Sorry for the delay, but we are back um, once again. So I know it kept recording. So sorry for the long silence. We are back. Would you do an NHL spin the wheel? So give me a minute. I'm going to get spin the wheel up. <sighs> Uh, we are missing a team, so I'm going to edit the wheel online. No, we are missing, we are missing the Seattle Packers. I'm going to eliminate real quick. Let me just test it out real quick. Just to make sure we can eliminate a team. Let's say oh, it is out. What did that one go We cannot eliminate them. That's not going to work, that. We need to be able to eliminate teams. Uh, is they're not going to be to roll. You have to go to World Wall. Let's see. World Wall. Better do it. Please tell me I can win the team. I can't edit the file, though, so let's see. Okay, I know World Wall can definitely eliminate, so I can already get to that. So obviously I'm going to add the Seattle Kraken real quick because obviously that team's not on there. I don't know why no one added the poor Seattle Kraken, but you need to add the Seattle Kraken. John, okay, but I'm going to do that with the Seattle Kraken. All teams but the Kraken once again, so I need to add an item. And we are going to add the Seattle Kraken. We are adding the Kraken. Done, Kraken's added. I'm gonna share my screen and we are gonna get started with the first ever edition of the spin the wheel. Now, with the spin the wheel, I'm obviously not gonna be 100% right because it's just a realistic simulation, but it's just to see who wins the cup, um, just for the fun of it. And yeah, whether they're even gonna make the playoffs or not. If the team doesn't make the playoffs, obviously, and I'm gonna be reacting to this because I'm gonna watch the whole video back again, I guarantee you that. So. I think it was the Stanley Cup playoffs come around. I'm gonna want to do that, and I'm gonna make my bracket actually based on. I'm gonna do another spin the wheel with the 16 teams that are in, um, and do like a best of seven simulation, and yeah, that's gonna determine my bracket. So let's say Nashville, Colorado goes over. Yeah. That's how I'm gonna yeah. determine my bracket. So yeah. let's get to it. So let's start it. I'm gonna go into full screen here, and let's spin our first team to get eliminated. It better not be the Kraken afterwards. Yeah, I want the Islands to finally win a cup. And pretty realistic, it's going to be the Anaheim Ducks. And I'm eliminated. Now, at the point that we do get to the final 16 teams, those teams are going to make the playoffs, basically, is what I'm trying to say. So Anaheim will not make the playoffs. Okay, I don't like this. Neither will the Colorado Avalanche. That is going to be interesting. The Colorado Avalanche will not play, make the playoffs either. So we have two eliminated to 30 now to go. 29 to go, Winnipeg. That's okay. I'm not too bad about that. Winnipeg's out. 29 to go now. We don't hear it. Okay. I don't like this where it's going. Oh, I thought it was going to land on New York. It went to Detroit. So Detroit is eliminated. So Pretty realistic here. We'll keep going with them. And I obviously have to count for the final six days. I'm sure she lost with them. And we have the Ottawa Senators. That is interesting, to be honest. I mean, realistic, to be honest. We have lost. We have one, two, three... Let me go to my entry list here. How many entries do you have right now? So let me go. How many entries do I have? Let me edit. So they're not reset. What? You also let me go back then. If it reset the wheel, I'm fine with that. Yeah, it reset the wheel. I'm fine with that. We're gonna restart it. Ready? We'll restart the 32 teams right now. I mean the volume up here, right? Three, two, one, go. And by lucky took the Seattle Kraken. Alright, now obviously the Kraken weren't eliminated. I'm gonna do another spin just bear. 
31 teams to go. Obviously, I have to keep track with 31 teams left. Chicago is eliminated. Thirty teams left. The Colorado Avalanche are eliminated. Twenty nine teams left. The Winnipeg Jets are eliminated. Twenty eight teams left. Wow, the Edmonton Oilers are eliminated. Twenty eight. Twenty-seven teams left. The Florida Panthers are eliminated. And now there are twenty-seven left. It's gonna be the sixteen with twenty-five left. The Seattle Kraken are eliminated. I'm okay with to be honest. I'm okay with that. I can't redo it to be honest. With you. Twenty-five left. With 24 teams left, the Washington Capitals are eliminated. He is going to get the night out. With, with 23 teams left in the playoffs, the Boston Bruins are eliminated. We still have 23 spots left. Twenty-three spots. Twenty-three spots left. The Pittsburgh Penguins are eliminated. So now there are twenty-two spots. Oh my god! With twenty-two spots, it's gonna go to the LA Kings. They are out. With twenty-two spots, the LA Kings are out. With 21 spots, the National Predators are out. 20 remain now. With 20 spots, the Buffalo Sabres are eliminated. 20 spots are eliminated. Yeah, 19 spots are eliminated. With 19 spots left after before the elimination, Tampa Bay is in 18 to go. Tampa Bay is out eliminated. Both New York teams are doing well with 18 to go. To be honest, I think they could win. Uh, eight, 18 t- teams left. The San Jose Sharks are out. 17 teams are remaining in the playoffs. <laughs> With 17, te- 17 teams left, the Toronto Maple Leafs are eliminated. Last spot to make it into the playoffs, or you are out. Last spot, or you're out if you win the wheel. Oh, it's going to go on Dallas Stars. The Dallas Stars are eliminated. Let me just make sure we have 16 before we get started. So Dallas will not win the cup. Let me just make sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yep, we have 16 teams left. 16 teams left, but to get to the next one, we get out of the playoffs first. And the Montreal Canadiens are going home for Montreal. And they have lost. Yeah, she's and the Ottawa Senators, who can't believe it, I can't believe they even made the playoffs, are going home. Calgary out? I think Calgary's out, by the way. I, I don't know, to be honest. Oh, and it's Carolina who's going home. It could be an Arizona Final Four, just so you guys know. It could be. It's Car- is, um, Calgary's in. Calgary's in. I'm kind of on a Calgary Rangers final. That'd be insane. Uh, and 
Looks like my Calgary Rangers final will not happen as I the Rangers are eliminated. So we're gonna resume that because I think that the Rangers are still in. The Rangers are still in. So let's see who's gonna take it. Oh, and St. Louis is eliminated. Now a lot of you are gonna erosion in the comments, and that's not fair. It is totally fair that I was able to redo it. Because I didn't see what how close it was, so it is totally fair. I'm able to redo it, which I used my one to redo. So now I'm not allowed to redo it anymore. And it's going on the Vegas Golden Knights. They are eliminated. The Vegas Golden Knights. I am absolutely hor a horrible fan of Vegas. So we'll do this twice, obviously. This time. And it's looking like the Rangers Cup final hope appearance is over. I can't, that one's not a redo, so Islanders are the only New York team as long as the Devils, I believe. Are. So in here, I saw them. Yep, the Devils are in here. And they are out! The New Jersey Devils are out. I think the New Jersey is still in there. So there's New York and Philly. Um, I don't know what happened to Pittsburgh. I, I guess Pittsburgh got out, or are they just not in the lineup? No, I think Pittsburgh was. I think Pittsburgh got out randomly. I didn't see that. Detroit's out? Okay. Oh, shoot. I hit spin it again. No. No. So Detroit's in, apparently. And Anaheim's out now, which is fine. But Detroit is still in. Just calm this. Uh, I was not unrealistic. Uh, and okay, like it's gonna go on Vancouver Canucks. They are out. Vancouver Canucks are out. So, looking like it's gonna get down to the final six, seven teams. So, we the Philadelphia Flyers, the Calgary Flames, the New York Islanders, the Minnesota Wild, the Arizona Coyotes, the Columbus Blue Jackets, and the Detroit Red Wings remain. Let's see who's gonna get out next. Will it be the Islanders or the Devils? Devils are out, though. No, Devils are in there, so. Columbus is out. Actually, are Devils in the final six? No. Devils are out of the final six, okay. So we have Arizona, surprisingly. Detroit, again, surprisingly. Philadelphia, really surprising. Calgary, okay, that's not that surprising. Minnesota, that's not that surprising. New York, Islanders, so that's. Surprising, we are going to spin it and stop it. Three, two, one, stop! Dead name three on Arizona. Four Coyotes, dominant season. The poor Arizona Coyotes. So, final five. So, we'll see who wins our final four. Oh, and it's going to Detroit with the dominant season is out. Final four are the Philadelphia Flyers, Calgary Flames, New York Islanders, and the Minnesota Wild. I think New York's doing strong. I mean, considering New York and Philadelphia are staying strong, and just as I said that, it's clearly on the Calgary Flames. Calgary is out. I can see just as I said the New York guy. Final three right now, it's in New York, Minnesota, and Philadelphia. So let's see who makes it to the final. I'm going to see that. I guarantee you this is a round where Minnesota's going to be out. I'm not hoping that they're out, but obviously I'm not too offended if they are out. But we are going to have to stop spinning at this point, and it is looking like my prediction wrong. So Minnesota and New York are going to face off with each other in the Stanley Cup final. This should be a fun one. Who's going to win? Is it? And it actually does work out that one Eastern Conference team is going to be facing one Western Conference team. And that, that's awesome. And it just worked out uh, that Eastern is Western. I don't want to. But yeah, obviously I'm gonna redo it real quick. That was a lot of time. 
present of the murder of the Messiah. Then the cup final spit it. Three, two, one, spit it! One, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now officers can be a best of seven again, by the way. So. It is lit. so Minnesota is down one nothing. If you get picked here, you lose. You lose. Minnesota is down one nothing and one two three four one two three four and Minnesota is tied. Minnesota is tied. Oh, I hit spin it again, so Minnesota is not tied yet. Minnesota is not tied yet. They're two nothing down. Two nothing down. I have to wait till this. That's right, Minnesota's two nothing down. No, I hit spin it again. And Minnesota's still two nothing down. Damn it. Three nothing down now. Minnesota's on the verge of elimination to crown New York Islanders the Stanley Cup finals, to be honest. So. Minnesota are three down. Now, a lot of you are going to be like, oh, well, now you, uh, now you try to do so. Well, yeah, I keep hitting spinners, so, yeah, unfortunately, so I'm going to put my mouse over here. And Minnesota are out four in a row losses. They made it to the final, but they are officially out. I'm going to bring you guys to my home quick and yeah so that that's that's gonna do it for today obviously i want to see who your 2023 stanley cup champion is who is also your 2023 stanley cup champion um let me know in the hang on one second let me know in the comment section down below who is your 2022 stanley cup champion um obviously it's Tampa Bay, please don't let me know. I absolutely hate Tampa Bay. Sorry, all of you Tampa Bay Lightning fans, but um, please don't let me know if you're a Tampa Bay fan. Just kidding, you actually can. I don't mind if they win three in a row. I'd rather not see them do the cup like 500 years in a row. But I feel like Toronto's going to try to give them a run for their money, obviously, and I think Toronto could have a chance at it in game seven on home ice. We're back. Um, so yeah, my prediction is Minnesota losing the cup. So, obviously, New York Islanders are going home to stay with them. We'll also see. We'll see. If, let me just check real quick before I let you guys go. Do we have an update on Barry Trotter real quick? But if we do, I'd like to know now. I don't want to do a new reaction. It is a waste of your time and a waste of my time. So, I'd rather not find out. Let me see if we got another berry chocolate. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay, guys. I want a minute. We have some big news. So one day ago, Barry Chop was spotted in Washington after being fired by the New York Islanders. So let me read this news real quick and I'll share it back to you guys. Could Trotsky, could Peter Lavio let be replaced or Trotsky goes as assistant and not head coach? The combined could be, a, to be honest, could be a nice little unit. Let's see, Barry Trot.
Okay, so basically Tampa, um, the, I, I don't know where she's going to go, but she could go to Washington and watch people are playing. So, yeah, should we do it? <laughs> okay, you know what? Let me Google uh, Barry Trot's destinations, potential, and we are going to put them in the spin wheel. Let's see where I can keep going. Let me see what there is. Let me search Barry Trot potential. A potential team. Kelly, we use the top five, so I do have top five here. Give me a minute. Open them. Let me open my spin wheel again real quick. We're gonna use the real name for this one for the fun of it. Actually, what's the point of doing? We're not gonna do it, guys. I'm gonna have to end it here. I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm sorry for not tomorrow next week. I'm sorry once again for the late video. Next week I'll be back on point with no more late videos. I promise you. Next week no more late videos. I'm sorry for the late video today. I that's truly really on me. I should have realized that I wasn't going to be able to record it yesterday and posted a late video yesterday. Actually, as a time, I'm going to give you guys a little bonus content. So, since we have like seven minutes left, I'm going to give you guys so it's 2 13. So, I'll give you guys till about 2. Can't give you guys extra today. So, I'll give you guys extra when I need, can. Um, hopefully, I'm like familiar, really, maybe a little special. Sunday videos. Yeah, that's gonna do it for this one, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I appreciate you. Also, if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button. I appreciate that. Um, new updates uh, will be released next week on the channel and our official schedule. I can't then figure one out right now. It's at that five, but. I might have to move it to Friday at 5. Um, obviously, this one being published now, and the ESN is done being recorded today. Obviously, you guys are seeing it now. Uh, I really felt bad. So, we could have a special Sunday video. I'll try to give you guys half an hour extra on the flight simulator. I mean, I really appreciate the time of you guys even bothering to check out my channel and staying with me even though i haven't been able to upload i appreciate every 216 of you subscribers as well for keeping me going um i'm gonna put some of my subscribers in the spin the wheel tomorrow um and yeah as you be that sorry about that not spin the wheel we already did that so what we're gonna do tomorrow is actually yeah um, today i actually had the results of in the wheel written down on a piece of paper. So let me open that on my phone. Sorry, so let me read you. I, I put five channels in and I put ten um uh five subscribers in. Now we do have a six subscriber disclaimer. We do have a six sorry, five subscribers. Let me tell you. So um Okay. Let me get back to you guys real quick. So, yeah, so what we're going to do is I have five shout outs, five subscribe, five YouTube channel shout outs. I'm going to give you those now. First one goes to George Ringle. Second one goes to Tim and James. The second and third, Tim and James McGuire. Fourth one goes to Matthew Mugio, and the last one goes to Nicole Bourgeois. The next five are all channels. The first one, Off the Wall Hockey. Second one, GM Anton Z. Third one goes. Yeah, third one goes to Off the Wall Hockey. And who does our fourth one go to, you ask? Our fourth one goes to Phil the Surreal. And our last and final one goes to Phil the Thrill's buddy, Tommy MS. Thank you all for your support and inspiring me and my YouTube career. Uh, we'll be doing this next week as well. It's going to be an every week thing, but only five. 
will be drawn instead of 10, but we are doing the 10 at the 200 subscriber shout out celebration. Thank you very much um, for all the support to all of you 216 subscribers. It really means a lot to me, and I truly appreciate it. If you would like to subscribe now, it's not too late to be entered in the next week's contest. You have till Thursday, 5 o'clock, 2 30. You so Thursday, one thirty. Oh, sorry, you have till Tuesday, 9 a.m. to do that to subscribe, and I will check the notification to drive out with every day at 11 a.m. So if you subscribe by 11 a.m., I will see it, or I'll see it the Tuesday. Uh, Tuesday, though, I will check at 9 a.m. when I do it to the top five. No one subscribes, so obviously, we'll just do it again. To the same. Thank you very much for. I was doing again. Thank you very much for checking out today's video, and I hope to see you next week on Shark Beat. And peace out.